Hello, and welcome to my first playthrough of Me Sao. Pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. I apologize if I'm wrong. Um, so yes, I'm going to be playing Me Sao, and truth be told, I have looked up playthroughs and stuff like that. Um, and I know the storyline, blah blah blah. I'll still try to make this entertaining. I promise, I'll try. And um, let's begin. Enter the girl's name with the keyboard. <laughs> let's see. Bitch face. That sounds accurate. Now let's go bitch tits. There we go, bitch tits. He's bitch tits, alright. Yes. I could do bitch tits, Nikki. Help! Find me. <clears throat> uh, Michelle? Is that you, Michelle? Michelle! What? Uh, was I dreaming? I thought I heard Michelle. I guess it was just a dream. It's been three months. Oh no, it's so late. I'm going to be late for school. Miss Sow has never stood out much in our class. She was a simple girl, really, and I'm just talking to no one. It was too close. I wasn't too close to her, but I was always worrying about Miss Sow being alone. Aren't you a good soul? I hoped I could be her friend, but that didn't happen. Three months ago, Misao went missing. She wasn't coming to school, and she hadn't come home either. She's not the type to flee home. Our parents were saying that she might have got involved in something. Well, I'm off! I'm assuming I have parents. Our class put the rumor that Misao was long dead by now. Bum bum bum! I really hope they were wrong. I wanted to be her friend. I'm pretty sure I changed her voice at some point. Find me. <laughs> So here, and then you have the attractive teacher of Bitch Tits class, popular with students for his generosity. Mr. Soto's cool as ever! That voice I heard in my dream was that Misao. You've got gut- I uh, frack, I forgot his voice already. You've got guts to ignore my lecture. Eek! This information will be essential for the test, so you better listen. Yes, yes, sir, I'm sorry. I don't know, it's giggling. <laughs> The wind wants to join in. Ah, oh, crap, forgot to do the neck thing. Mr. Soda has a new suit! Like, wow, super suave! But it's best friend, a fad following girl who looks up to Mr. Soda. Ayaka, you've been talking about him all morning. Don't you ever get tired of blabbing? But he's such a ladies man. He's so nice and smart and he's the best. <laughs> oh yeah, I gotta use some hand cream. Do 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 Did you hear? I did. There's a rumor Mr. Soda has a hand fetish. 
Oh my god! So maybe if I clean my hands constantly every day all the time, he'll be like, like me more. Huh. I don't really care, Ayaka. Don't really care, she says. Ha! You've got no eye for men, bitch tits. Seriously, why do you see this? I like Toma. I I never said I liked anybody. I just think he's kind of cool. After that's all. Really? <laughs> Me? Yes, really. You want to fight? Want to fight? You don't believe me? I spat on my screen. There's been some spooky paranormal business going on at the school. I'm getting a little freaked out. Paranormal, my ass! Vicious classmate, a boy carefree in appearance, personality, everything. I'm for real. It's for. S uh. I'm for real. It's for real. The other day, a kid in the other class got dragged away in a bathroom. Bitch tits classmate, leader of the bullies. There's also this glass in the third floor hallway being broken from inside. <gasps> Bitch tits classmate, come early maturing youth. Gotta be ghost. I'm scared. Vicious classmate, just a Tomei for short. Toma's girlfriend. I should probably be saying their name. Ghost, huh? Dumbass, this doesn't exist. Wait, what if this is Mrs. Kiss? They'll sound really stupid. I forgot his name. The sound of his voice. Um. Look, this is no time for jokes, man. But I mean, it's totally possible. It's been three months since she's vanished. This is then the stuff just suddenly stops. If those events are... If those events are... Mm, he's Japanese, I can't blame him for his bad English, I guess. If those events are Mrs. Kiss, then you should all be kissed sooner or later. What did I do? Yes, you know, you did bully Miss a lot. Bullying? Why, I never. I was just making a little fun. And Tomo is screwed with Miss You're the one who will get cursed. <laughs> ha! Fine, me? Ha! I'm fine. Miss looked after me. Wink, wonk. Ah! I wonder. Toma, I'm scared. I mean, I'm your girlfriend. Misao might have a grudge. Don't sweat it, Tome. Oh shit. Don't sweat it, Tome. I'll protect you. I just made the most pink couple. <laughs> oh, oh, you're so nice, Toma. Oh. Huh, what do you love? Do you what you like, love birds? Me so! Please don't curse us! The rest are fair game, though! Oops, did I say that out loud? <laughs> Thanks! Thanks, you fucking asshole! Now we're all fucking cursed because of you! Fuck you! An earthquake? Not nah, sure, yeah. What? What? It's got a dark red crack. What the heck's going on? Ah, uh, right quick. Yeah, right quick. Maybe, just maybe, it really is Michelle's cat. Michelle's real mad at us. Sh shut up! What the hell? I was just kidding about that curse crap. Ah, uh. no chance. Help! 
Miso? Miso? I can hear her speaking to me. Hallelujah! Oh, now it's gotta be her. Gotta be her. Sh shut up! I don't hear a damn voice! That's what you think. Bitch tits! You're talking crazy talk! I'm not! Ah! 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 Find me. <coughs> Misa. Oh. Help me, find me! <coughs> Help me, find me! <coughs> <laughs> Whoa! Oh, what just that? Nyung Mizo. Ha, you finally come to. <laughs> Where am I? I was just in the classroom. And who are you? I am Onigawara, the student council president. And this is the student council room. And ignore my resemblance to Ogre from Bad Father. We're totally the same person. <clears throat> Luckily for you, we've ended up somewhere safe. Ended up? After the earthquake, the school was sucked into another world. Isn't that awesome? This, those, this sent those inside flying all across the school. Another world? What's that supposed to mean? And why would that happen? Well, it's a curse. The most obvious answer, of course. Huh. It is the result of the girl's curse that the school was sealed in the other world. A curse? It couldn't be Miso? Mm. President Onikawawa! <laughs> Pat Pat finally made it. I thought I was a goner. So you finally returned, Miss Library. <laughs> She's the school's vice president, always in the library. So that's what we call her. So then, Miss Library, how does it look? It's messed up and gunked up and funked up. I changed her voice again. The foundation and everything's wrecked. And I haven't been able to find any exits. Plus, evil spirits are going and attacking people. I saw a student kill before my eyes. I'll never be able to eat hamburgers again. Oh, it's fattening. Oh, I see. Thank you for the report. You may retire now. Yes, well, I'm going to the library. Call me down. You need me, wing walk. You know, talking to you, gal. Evil spirits. The curse must have summoned them. Hmm, what happens? The school is now a den of spirits, and there's nowhere to run. <laughs> Um, there's only one solution. Undoing the girl's curse. There's surely no other way. Nah, how am I supposed to undo a curse? By saving the girl's soul, Miss Bishtits. You must know what it is you have to do. I do. Find me. <coughs> Miss Elle is calling me, so she wants to be found? Miss Elle Gawawa! I'll go look for Miss so. so you will. As Labor informs me, the school is full of evil spirits, and yet you wish to go. I will, because Miss so is my friend! Understood. You are entrusted with the fate of the school. I believe you can do it. Understood. If you encounter any trouble, pay a visit to the Labor on the second floor. She, oh, to library. She will try her best to help. If you wish to, ma wish to make a record, please talk to me. I would do f so for you any time. Wink, wonk. Yes, save. Data one. Oh, did I just save? Okay, whatever. Okay, I'm gonna... 
close the game here. Um, I pray for your safety. Let's save again. It's very safe. Yeah, save. Okay, I'm gonna stop here. Um, I'm gonna stop here. Thank you for watching this first episode of by myself. Uh, yeah.